in the hood video still here. Got three beautiful ladies right here. Ladies, could y'all please introduce yourselves? What's hey. up, you guys? I'm Mia. I'm Jenny G. Hi, my name is Arike. <laughs> and right. we're Before Dark, yeah. Oh, no doubt, no doubt. So tell us a little bit about Before Dark. Like, is this your first project? You know what I'm saying? What was it like being in the studio with, with your um, co-workers here? You know what I'm saying? And, and did anything exciting happen in the studio or crazy happen? Um, well, actually, the studio is one of my most favorite times with the group. Mm -hmm. um, we're crazy wherever we are, so... But um, it was pretty fun working with the producers and just singing. And we, this is our first project on RCA, our first album. Um, first single, kind of. You know, actually, Baby was our first single. This is it, our second one. And um, we get along good. She's my yeah. sister. She's like my cousin. We're all That's like family. So. All right, all right, all right. So um, I guess y'all met. For being in the same household, you know what I'm yeah, saying? But what made y'all decide to like? <laughs> Yo, yes, yeah. All right, y'all got a mama, brother, sisters too? Actually, she has two brothers. Yeah, my dad. Really. So, yeah. Okay. And then I have a brother and a sister back at home. Oh okay. yeah. I have lots of cabbage patch kids. All right. <laughs> All right. So, so what made y'all decide to call the group for a dog? Who was that? Actually, that was Jenny's idea. Mm -hmm. um, we all sat down and brainstormed. We were looking for a name because our, our former name couldn't be used anymore. So we were sitting down looking for a name. And she came up with Before Dark because we wanted something young, you know, youthful. And um, have you ever heard the saying, you know, your parents telling you, be in Before Dark, you better oh, be home yeah, Before Dark? Yeah, yeah. It was started off like that. And then as time progressed, it's, it's had new meanings. And it's come to mean, like, um, re reconciling Before Darkness, you know, solving all your problems before the darkness comes. Mm -hmm. And just the fact that we're so young, you know how people associate evil with darkness? Mm -hmm. It's kind of like we're, we're before the darkness because we haven't yet been exposed to all the corrupt things in the world. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all like good, basically, what you're saying. Well, not good, but <laughs> we are good. We're not bad, oh, no. We're not just like young. We haven't faced all the yeah. problems in life yet. You know, we're, since we're so young, we haven't had time to be bad. Uh -oh. Not that we're ignorant or anything. Yeah, like, you know what's going on in the world. Mm -hmm. But we just haven't yet been exposed to it, like, a lot. So we're going to corrupt y'all here and in the hood, all right? Oh, okay, okay. okay. I, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, um, like, some of the performance y'all did, who gave y'all, like, the most love so far and just went bananas? School. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's not so much um, a town or a city we visit. It's an age group. Mm -hmm. And we tend to get the most love from, like, our, our uh, middle school crowd because they're just so excited. And you know how older kids sometimes will sit back and they'll be too cool. And so they'll be like, yeah, you know, but I mean, and then guys, of course, guys are always responsive. But um, I would say that if we did a middle school tour and they were like, they helped us, egged us on, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because they're so uninhibited, they have no. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, they're not too cool to still get excited. Yeah. So like, um, do you have any other interests? Like um, who's rapping or acting or anything? Well, we all act. Oh, yeah. um, we started off acting actually, mm -hmm. and Arike dances like to dance. I actually I started off dancing, and mm -hmm. then I got into acting. Mm -hmm. So we all well, collectively we like acting, we like dancing, singing of course, mm -hmm. um, and we all like to hang out with our friends in our spare time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, y'all do have friends. Yes. <laughs> all right, all right. So um. It's lunchtime. You're saying, what do y'all like to eat for lunch? That's a, you know what? Give me five in the hood oh, okay, okay. for that question. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we like so much food. food. We yeah. love food. Yeah. Let's that. We, we always love tell food. people, we say, can you ask us some fun questions? Like, what's yeah. our favorite food? Yeah, yeah. What do you for like? Lunch? Oh, we like Shandara. It's a restaurant in yeah. L.A. It's a, chi it's a Chinese? Uh, Siamese cuisine. That's what it says. <laughs> but for a regular day of lunch, Chicken. if I had to pick, it would be like some... Fried chicken, some mashed potatoes, some lima beans. I take lima yeah. beans, yeah. cucumber, <laughs> tomato salad with Italian dressing. Oh. Um, we take chicken. I'll take chicken, chicken fingers and I'll take yeah. a fries. number six from McDonald's. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Hot dogs, which we had yesterday. That's mm -hmm. kind of funny. Last time I was in LA, I had jerk chicken pizza. Mm -hmm. oh. From where? <laughs> from a Spanish Cold Chinese pizza? store. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Gosh. Jerk. But yo, why don't y'all go? Jerk chicken, Jamaican food. Yeah, I don't know. Chinese. It was kind of good though. It looks pretty well. Hey, but um, we're going to kick it to a couple of videos and come right back with Before Dog.